I don't know if this is a glitch or if this is like actually what's going on, but Lululemon raised the price of the aligned $20. Oh my gosh, they, whoa. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley. If you're new here, if you're enjoying the content, make sure to give it a like and hit that subscribe button if you want to stick around for more. If you didn't see one of my last videos where I go into why I left my job at Lululemon, you can go check that out. But I do actually really enjoy filming these, so I do plan on keep making them if you keep watching them. Also, something that's really exciting is now I'm going to try my best to link as many of the products as I can below so that you can shop this video. They are going to be affiliate links, so if you do shop them, they do support me. But no worries at all if you don't want to use them. That is all good. The fact that you're even watching this just means so much to me and thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I... <laughs> I started laughing when I opened the app not too long ago because they brought back the shop what's new section. I <laughs> Oh my gosh, I thought it was so funny how many people were going off in the comments last week about how upset they were that the shop what's new section was like gone for almost a month I want to say. So I was so excited to see that it was back because not only does it make it easier for me to chat about new products with you guys, but also it's easier for everyone else to see what's new and shop it. I feel like I don't have to justify that. Okay, we're gonna move on. We're gonna move on with that train of thought. So we can shop what's new now, which is so exciting. <laughs> okay, so up top is the Ventilite Zipper Jumpsuit. Hmm. You know what? Okay, I'm gonna give them credit here because this looks like something that they would normally just put in Lululemon Lab and I've never seen Lululemon Lab products uh, in store and yeah, this just looks like something that they would normally just like give to Lululemon Lab, which is hard to find in store and typically you wouldn't be able to shop online. So I can appreciate that they are offering off something new for everyone. I don't necessarily think any of this is of my interest. Like I. There definitely are some cute jumpsuits out there. I don't necessarily think this is one of them, but if it's your vibe, then go for it. I don't know. I just feel like what's throwing me off about it is the drawstrings in the front. I just feel like are so in your face. I can appreciate though that I'm sure as you tighten them, it'll help like accentuate your waist. And I feel like the cutest jumpsuits have like the cutest little ways to accentuate your waist. But I, uh, yeah, I don't know. I wish like the top had something more to it rather than just like a normal collar line. Yeah, I'm gonna move on. Okay, so this color, do green. I literally, also the fact that they paired it with smoke spruce just kind of, I, I'm taking it as a personal attack because that looks stunning. <sighs> literally, you will soon see, I know I keep saying I'm doing a try on haul, but I kept ordering stuff up until my employee discount ended, which was last week. So I am waiting for the rest of the stuff to come in the mail so I can do a massive one. Hopefully I don't have to split it into two videos or maybe I will, or maybe it will just be really long and hopefully people will watch it. But I did get the Smoke Spruce Epta Train. This is my favorite Lululemon bra. I also started listing in the description of all of my videos, my favorite Lululemon products with the links to them so that you can find them more easily. But this color, I'm like super, I don't need it. I don't need it. I'm okay for right now. It's really nice though. I'm just going to keep telling myself I don't need it. A button front dress. Again, I can appreciate the, the, the leap of faith that they're, that they're tossing out in, into oblivion and hoping that it catches someone's eye. Okay. So like this, I can appreciate, like, I really like the way that it's ruched, but I guess like the way that they styled this model. It just looks like a lab coat, which coming from a scientist, I guess it doesn't, I don't even know what I'm trying to get at. It just looks like a lab coat. They're coming out with a lot more in Gold Spice and they have officially brought back We Are From Space and Nimbus Battleship for the season. Now, um, I wish I was kidding, but that is actually the name of this pattern. It was actually trademarked, so that is why the name is what what it is. Is a uh, Lululemon legally has to name it that really long name, um, and we is with two e's uh, as well. So it is a nice pattern, though. They bring it 
back pretty much every year. Tidewater teal oversized crew. The Tidewater teal is so pretty. I don't need it, but it's nice to look at. Okay, so this, I was super confused because I was like, okay, black aligns aren't new, Lululemon, like, nice try. But then I saw they were $118. I was like, okay, well, there must be something special. And then I used my eyes, which is crazy what happens when, like, you actually use your five senses to figure out things. And it's a jewel embossed black. But I don't remember the align, like, embossed patterns ever being more expensive. Whoa. Oh my gosh, this is like genuinely my live reaction. I don't know if this is a glitch or if this is like actually what's going on, but Lululemon raised the price of the aligns $20. So they are $118. $118. They used to be $98. I don't know if this is a glitch. I really don't. But that's insane. $20. And like, Especially when I used to work for the company, I heard how much it makes to make lines, and it is not anywhere near that margin. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm no business major. I get that, you know, inflation, and I'm sure they have their reasons, but that's insane. It says 98 to 118. So are the newer colors 118? I'm confused. Which ones are 98? Okay, I'm confused. I don't know if this is a glitch. I could, this could totally be a glitch of my phone. But like when I go back to what's new, it says Lululemon Align, trademark, pant 25 inches, 98 to 118. Oh my gosh, they, whoa. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that. Wow, oh my gosh, and $20 is a lot. That was, I'm not gonna do percentages right now. You would think I would be better with mathematical terminology. My, wow. Yeah, I don't understand, was that a glitch? Cause now it says the 28 lengths are 98. I really don't know. I really don't know. Was it a glitch? Let me try going back. No, see it says 118. Wait, let me try like, Adding a black pair of aligns 25 length to my cart. Okay, false alarm. I do think it was just the embossed fabric. I started clicking around and I, I, I think we're good. Cause that would have been like, whew, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. That was a false alarm. I did not mean to alarm you, although I very much alarmed myself. It, cause it looks like it. Well, you can see it cause I'm screen recording. Cause when I tap on different colors, it still comes up as 118. But then once I click on a size and then go back to a color. Yeah, because I'm used to the diamond dye being 118. Like that's, that's like been a standard that with the dye process, they charge more. Okay, false alarm, false alarm. Wow, okay, okay. Red Merlot is a new color. I really like Red Merlot. At first when I saw it, I thought it was like Cassis and the other like maroon colors, but this one's more of like a red, red wine. I think it's super pretty. Like if they came out with them and <laughs> me with everything, if they came out with it in Wonder Trains or like an All Yours tea. Oh my gosh, wait, if they actually came out with it in like a scuba oversized half sip. Okay, okay. I'm gonna stop like thinking about things because I can't be spending money right now. Okie dokie. Oh, literally. Okay, cool. Literally manifested that. Awesome, Ashley. They came out with Red Merlot in uh, Wonder Trains and it looks gorgeous. I don't need it, I don't need it, I don't need it, I don't need it, I don't need it. Maybe when it goes on Markdown, but even then I really don't need it. Literally manifested that. Cool, moving on. This pattern I am not a fan of. I don't think we talked about it last week. Uh, again, I talk too much, sometimes I forget. I mean, this isn't terrible. I'm quite indifferent, but I would not wear it. My eyes kind of hurt even looking at it. More shorts, and then they came out with pink mist. Again, at this point, there's been so many light pinks that I just can't keep up. Because, like, there were light pink scuba joggers, maybe. Could totally be wrong. So that's not super exciting. More short colors. Oh, that's interesting. Larkspur is an old color. 
like this was out beginning of last year I want to say and you know they've come out with more in this color but I haven't seen much of it so that's interesting. They're really starting to push the Beyond the Studio Jogger a lot more. It's okay so I never was a massive fan of the Dance Studio Jogger which is essentially what this one is but slightly different. Like I had nothing against them I just like never had a reason to need them but with these let me see if I can get them in a different color. Yeah, there's like so much ruching down the side and personally that's a bit much for me. Like I do see the appeal, just not my vibe. Okay, love, they changed this. Love crew short sleeve t-shirt. They want to be more descriptive, I guess, because love love crew wasn't descriptive enough. Okay, okay, Lulu, we, we got it. Yeah, and even here now they're having the name all tied up tank Pima Cotton. Well, actually no, now there's two different materials that are in the all tied up so never mind i guess that makes that makes sense we're good this is just your daily reminder that if you want any shorts of any kind whether they're biker shorts not biker shorts tennis skirts any of all of the above if there is something in stock right now drop the money and get it right now because i guarantee you in a month it will be almost impossible to get like anything um, because production is still pretty, is definitely slower due to the pandemic still. And also things are still being prioritized for online orders. So the stores aren't getting sent as much stuff still. So if something goes out of stock, it's probably going to be a while and they're going to restock in like very, very, very small amounts. Like I ordered something last week and as I was checking out, it said there was only three left in stock. So just if you want any shorts of any kind, especially a line short, six inch, those are gonna literally go and we will never see them again until like November, get them now. Oh, they came out with so many colors in the All Yours tees. Wheat yellow, I might have to snag that when it goes on markdown. And heather blue linen, yes. And I, I could debate yellow pair too. Cloudy wash golden apricot too. Literally, this is the one I'm wearing right now, woo! Um, clearly couldn't wait for my haul because I'm wearing it now. But yeah, a lot of these colors, especially wheat yellow and heathered blue linen, I will be checking Thursday mornings around 7 to 7.30 a.m. EST for the markdowns to go. But these definitely won't be going on markdown until June. Like early mid-June is probably my guess. Yes, okay, good. They're coming out with more Teal Lagoon. This is such a pretty pretty color and I love the way that they paired that. Wait, Love Crew Slub? Is that a new material? I'm confused. What word is slub? Slub. What is going on? Oh, mm -hmm. softly textured Pima Cotton fabric. Yeah, but they're normally made out of Pima Cotton. I'm confused. What is a slub? I think they just named the texture. I don't, that's a weird word to choose. Like, yeah, let me get the Love Crew Slub, please. A what? Yeah, the Slub. Okay. Okay. Ooh, more track fat shorts. Okay. My favorite are the trackers, which are almost essentially the same thing as these, but they're four inches. And the track cutter, five inches. But good. I'm happy they're coming out with more colors because I would never wear shorts that are low rise and two and a half inches. Like there's literally this much fabric. Like I'm not even exaggerating. Like the two and a half inches are so short. Like I cannot imagine going out in public in them. Like I would feel so uncomfortable. So I'm happy that they're restocking and creating new colors for other shorts that aren't the two and a half inch hotty hot or speed ups. More colors in the Wonder Train Longline bra. No thank you. Ooh, this is pretty in the Kate's tee. Heathered rosemary green. Oh, I know, crisp and green has been out. But the heather, that's pretty. That's pretty. Keep that, keep that in my noggin. This is atrocious. Moving on. So this came out last week, but because the what's new section wasn't really a thing, I literally had no idea these came out until I walked in my store and I saw them hanging up. And I was like, wow, I clearly could not find those on the website. This is kind of cute. I like the way they did the veil because the the veil they came out with last year was more like mosaic tile. 
at least one of them was but i actually really like the way they did this one spiced chai i don't believe i saw this in any of the other aligns but the super high rise I'm sorry, I still just can't get over the fact that like I had a mini heart attack that like aligns were 118. Like I apologize to you guys too. Like that I'm I, I hate to say it, but I wouldn't be surprised if they do raise the price soon. Cause I don't know, I just feel like that's something that Lululemon would do. Ooh, this is interesting. Mystified white opal. It's kind of like a marble dye almost. I do like the Rain Chaser, but again, they just recently made it online only. So that kind of bummed me out. I When I tried it on, I forget what size I was. I want to say I might have been a 6 or an 8. I can't remember because it's quite boxy. So normally I would do an 8, but I don't know if I size down. I don't remember. See, that's what I'm saying. Oh, another thing. They're bringing back the All Yours dresses. Now, I feel bad because they were out last year, and I actually really like the colors that they came out in. But they were on markdown for a really long time. Like, they really struggled to get rid of them. And I can't remember if I tried them on. I think I just, in the end, deemed that, like, I wouldn't wear it enough, so I couldn't justify it. But, like, I do think they're super cute. Oh, I they definitely raised the price. They were not $98 last year. Like, think about it. It's an elongated t-shirt and it's $98. Like that's, that's a bit much. It's a, like, yeah, I think they were like 68 last year. Cause, okay, I, can, I can't wrap my head around that. Like it's literally a longer t-shirt with like some extra flow and it's $98. And it's actually $98. Like I'm clicking around and it's actually $98. I didn't mess up the price this time. Oh. A Swiftly Tech high neck. Interesting. Hmm. I have not seen you in a really long time. Because, okay, so my issue with the Swiftly is like so many of, okay, when I say so many, I mean like 98% of my bras from Lululemon are all high neck because the ones that aren't high neck are like not supportive at all for anything above a C cup. And then I do have a Swiftly tank, like a normal one, but I never wear it because like the shirt like cuts down and then my bras up here and it just looks really awkward so this is actually like super accommodating and i definitely appreciate that okay this is again i talk so much i could have brought this up last week the stretch high-rise short this is essentially like the revamp of the on the fly short do i have an on the fly short or is it called something else i have the you know what let me get them Okay, mini show and tell time. I don't remember what these are called, but I believe these were three or three and a half inches. This is carnation red, so that is why it's literally blinding. Um, so I hope that doesn't hurt your eyes. But essentially it does, it has the drawstring. And it's, yeah, I think, I can't remember what these were called. It has like the traditional Lululemon seam. Don't know if you can see that around the back don't remember if anyone remembers what these are called i don't know if they were the on the fly shorts or if they were something else let me know down in the comments because my brain is not working right now okay i do have an update on the relaxed fit super high rise french terry full length jogger um so i did see them in person a co-worker before i left was wearing them and they're quite billowy like although it is like a stiffer fabric overall like it is a thick fabric they are quite billowy so without trying them on in person i would be worried that they would literally make my thighs look three times the size that they are so i don't know necessarily anymore if this is for me but if anyone's tried them again let me know in the comments because i would totally be open to trying them on and seeing what i think okay i was about to like crap on this but after thinking about it, I think it kind of makes sense. Because, you know, okay, we've we've been through the saga together. Lululemon has come out with some weird, weird crossbody monstrosities. But this, I could kind of see, like, your phone going in the big one and maybe, like, your AirPods going in the small one. Still not something I would get, but, like, I can see, I can see the usage of this, like, right on the spot. 
Okay, and we are going to end off there. Oh, also, I guess another mini update is, so they did add like the mini Lululemon hand sanitizers. And I believe one singular one is $8, like tiny, 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 like tiny, tiny. I, I don't know how many ounces. I could have sworn I saw a three pack of mine. I don't remember. Anyway, so I guess if you want to try it and you don't want to spend $30, there is another option for you. But if you came this far, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to head to this playlist if you want to watch some of my past anti-hauls and keep up with all of the fun Lou Lemon content, as well as if you want to learn a little bit more about my life, I do have a whole playlist for all of my vlogs too. So, woo! Okie dokie. Well, I hope you have a great rest of your week. Happy May. It is getting nice out and I am so excited. Like I'm normally not a summer person, but like the extended daylight is like doing great things for me and praise. Okie dokie. Well, it came as far. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you guys next time. Bye.